So what is a webhook? A webhook is a way for applications to communicate and automatically share data whenever a change occurs. Webhooks allow different applications to share data in real time. Here's how it works. In this example, Caspi is the source application, a support ticketing form to submit data. An event such as inserting, updating, or deleting data will trigger a notification or a webhook to send a payload, which is sent automatically to a third party, the target service. In today's video, we'll set up an outgoing webhook in Caspio to notify users inside our team's channel whenever a new support ticket comes in. In Caspio, I'll select the webhooks tab and click create outgoing webhook. Let's name this webhook notifications to team's channel. Now we need to add the outgoing URL to where the data will be sent. The outgoing URL is typically provided by the target service. Next, we need to create an event which will trigger the outgoing webhook to send the specific data, which is called a payload. First, select the table. In advance, I've already created my table that is going to store the support ticket information. We have three different types of events to choose from. Trigger the outgoing webhook when new data is inserted, existing data is updated, or data is deleted. We're going to choose Insert. Finally, select the Custom Payload tab and click Start to configure the payload. Most third-party services, in this case Teams, provide you with the payload structure they expect in order to send the data to their system. I will paste the payload structure that I copied from Teams, and then I'll update the fields to match the fields from my Caspio table. Let's apply and save the changes. Now that the event is set up, after submitting the form through our Caspio application, we can push the data to Teams and check how it's formatted. From there, I could change the presentation or formatting as I need. For users with programming skills, you can also use Caspio's REST API to generate webhooks programmatically. As seen here, you can use Caspio's integration with Spiger UI to verify and test various webhook functions. Going back to my account, I'd like to highlight a few more features available in Caspio webhooks. In the outgoing webhooks list, I can see activity for a specific time frame and check the stats for messages, calls, and errors. For any webhook, I can edit the details as well as change the maximum number of calls per second based on the resources of my Caspio plan. With Caspio webhooks, the integration possibilities are endless, and we're excited to see what you will build. For a full list of features and improvements, visit our online help at howto.caspio.com. Thanks for watching.